Let's go take some pictures. We're off this month to the vivid terrains of Southwest Colorado. We kick things off at Four Corners, where four states come together. Explored the mysterious Mesa Verde ruins. Ate dinner by a Durango campfire. Trailed the steam train puffing its way to Silverton. Tested our off-roading skills in the San Juan Mountains. And even managed to fit in some shopping in Telluride, where my wallet cried for mercy. Now, let me show you the stunning landscapes that were worth every bump and scrape along the way. Ah, Cinnamon Pass. It's not just a spice in your latte. It's a gateway to the photographic divine. Poughkeepsie Gulch. Try saying that three times fast. Or better yet, just snap a picture. It'll last longer. Lake Como. No, not the Italian getaway, but still a paradise if you're into dirt, rocks, and soul-stirring landscapes. Engineer Pass, don't need a degree for this one, just a camera and an eye for the drop dead gorgeous. Step House Ruins, less stepping, more awe inspiring decay. Perfect for history buffs and dramatic Instagram feeds. Tower House. If you were a queen or a wizard, you'd live here. But for now, we'll just capture its majesty. Sunset House, where the sun and your camera lens meet in a romantic tango. Black Ruins, for when you're in the mood for something a little more mysterious, spooky, and photogenic. It's the whole package. Twilight Peak. No vampires. I promise. Just celestial dances of light and shadow. Modern Downtown Silverton is pretty much the same as old downtown Silverton. Come for the vintage charm and stay for the photo ops. Ure's Red Mountain. Not just any mountain, it's a red mountain. Color yourself impressed. The peaks and valley of a rustic retreat. Unplug your phone. Your hiking boots and camera are about to get a workout. Thanks for watching our tour of Southwest Colorado. If you enjoyed the show, then please don't leave us hanging. 